Hello guys, thanks for checking out my channel. I'm going to show you some interesting possibilities that you will have with Raphael if you land a successful little hit uh, B after landing a reversal edge in the second round. So here it is near the wall. You can land a second and third and so on reversal edge after the opponent wall splats like that, like what you see here. Of course, the opponent can guess right, but uh, nevertheless, the first hit of the reversal edge after the wall splat is guaranteed and takes damage, so you can take advantage of that. But of course, there are many more possibilities, like what you see here. Again, landing the second round of the reversal edge B near the wall, and you can do a combo like that. The cool thing about uh, this uh, sequence is that you build a lot of meter and you can, from zero meter, you can just uh, have uh, enough for a super. Here is another possibility. I don't like the scaling here, but it's still something like 90% damage. Of course, if you guess uh, correctly two times. So Astaroth has his uh, ring out uh, house screen possibilities, but the Raphael can be pretty deadly if you are able to land that here in this situation, so see what's going on. So you can of course land the uh, 4-4-B-K after a Shadow of 8-B, it's a pretty standard sequence. I don't like the 4-A-B ender, but it's something to keep in your arsenal in case you're playing against uh, larger body characters so here is uh, what you can do if you have soul charge you can land the 9ab with this sequence and the last hit is guaranteed in certain angles near the wall so again it's something like 90 percent combo here is another possibility if you have a soul charge you can uh, have a better ender there with uh, 1kb. Here is another combo route that utilizes b4. Uh, I don't like the wall splat of this move in this particular game, in the previous games it was better, but uh, nevertheless you get a combo here, like that. Now let's explore the throw possibilities in this situation. So as uh, you can see here, the opponent is turned backwards, so you can land a back throw, which is absolutely guaranteed, you cannot uh, escape uh, side or back throws in this game. So that's a cool little trick that you can have up your sleeve. And uh, here is the quote-unquote death combo. If you're in soul charge, you can land uh, the standard throw like that, and uh, as you can see, just kills the opponent with the follow-up. This throw can be escaped, of course, but uh, I think that most people would be pretty unprepared to eat a throw from Raphael Wall characters in this situation, so uh, it's good to have that in your arsenal. Alright guys, thanks for checking out my video. I will be uploading much more Soul Calibur 6 content here, so subscribe if you feel like it. Thanks and have fun with this great, awesome game.